There's a farm just north of the city that's working to preserve an art form we'll see at the Tokyo Olympics. Arts correspondent Angel Edow takes us to Temple Farms and the Lipazon Stallions. They're teaching to dance. And we're trying to keep the art form alive. We're trying to keep the training and the history involved in the current day. We're one of the few places still doing it. It's at Temple Farms in Old Mill Creek, Illinois, that a rare horse breed known as the Lipazon Stallion is trained in dressage, or a form of equestrian riding. They all have different styles, different techniques. We have working hand horses, long rein horses, horses that are in the quadrille. This horse is the solo horse. So he shows all the movements of the high school in front of the crowd by himself. So we always take some of our most talented horses and develop them into solo horses. Now it's usually about four years before a Lipizan stallion like Cookie here begins their formal equestrian training. A lot of people don't realize the amount of time that we put into these horses before they're ready to perform. It is a lifelong endeavor for both the riders and the horses. Now the relationship is built over a five to six year period with trainers working with the horses for about an hour a day. Once they've got their routines down, it's showtime. In the center we have Aurelia. She's a 16 year old mare with very unusual markings. The show, weekly dance recitals of course. It's the newest educational opportunity offered by Temple Farms where attendees can learn more about the art form. This breed was established 400 years ago. Beginning with the youngest of our herd, our foals, we moderate basically what it is about the Lipazon horse that enables it to uh, do what is what we call dancing, which is dressage. So we actually show from young horse to intermediate horse to advanced horse what it is that the rider is doing. Program director Esther Bonanno narrates these weekly recitals. And while she's not a trainer, Bonanno says it's both the horse's natural ability and curiosity to adapt to this art form that makes her proud to educate people on this historical legacy. These stallions learn to work with one another, next to one another. They learn to not just move on straight line and circles, but to cross their legs over in really elegant ways. We even do a pirouette in dressage so that rather than doing a circle on a straight line, they are now doing a circle, carrying themselves on their hind ends. And then what we even do here at Temple Lipizzans, which is not done anywhere else here in the country, is the airs above the ground. And these are former battle maneuvers stylized into an art form where you actually see horses jump up off of their feet and kick in the air. I love it. It's, Show it's, attendee it, and former it, rider it, Kathy it, agrees. It, she says to witness the Lipizzan Stallions perform in person is truly a once in a lifetime experience. They emanate a presence and an energy and a power. And to see the way they listen to their trainers, I don't think that you can ever fully capture classical riding unless you're right here. For Chicago Tonight, I'm Angel Ito. If you are interested in learning more about how the Lipizzans dance, classes continue through the beginning of September on select Wednesdays, Saturdays, and Sundays. We have ticket information and more on our website. And now, Amanda, back to you.